I don't know what that was. <laughs> I just drank coffee and it's Friday and I'm super excited. Woo! Okay. Hello, my friends in virtual tutor land. Tutor time with Mrs. Norwood. Okay, so you remember last vid, we started talking about multiplying by multiples of 10 and we used base 10 blocks to demonstrate that concept. So if you remember, when you multiply a number by a multiple of 10, your product or your answer is going to increase by that same multiple of the 10. Correct? Correct. It's like jumping from one place to the next in your place value chart. It's a times 10. Same thing. Okay. So when it comes time for the EOG, are they going to let you have base 10 blocks? Nope. So we're going to do the same thing today, except we're going to use pictures. So you can draw pictures when it's EOG time, test time, quiz time, Fab Four time, whatever time. If you feel like drawing a picture, let's do it. Okay. Same concept. Pictures, not blocks. So. I wanted to show you how you can draw best 10 blocks. Okie dokie. So here's your thousands cube, right? So I have a thousand ones in here. How you can draw your thousands cube. Make your part a square and then do a doopy doopy on the end. The doopy doopy is what makes it different from your hundreds flat. Right? Right. So Here's your hundreds flat, hundred ones in here. There's what it looks like picture form. There's your 10 stick. Stick, 10 stick, get it, yep, uh-huh. One's cube, one's cube slash dot slash little bing bong there, all right? So here's how you draw your thousands cube. Here's how you draw your hundreds flat. Here's how you draw your 10 stick. Here's how you draw your one. Yeah, now you can see my phone. Okay, so let's look at one, shall we, friends? Two times nine. Two groups of nine. Alrighty. So I have one, two groups, and I'm going to have nine in them. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Nine. How many do I have all together? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18. So 2 times 9 is 8. Eight. All right. What about 2 times 90? Two groups of 90. 1, 2. All right. 10 sticks. 9 in each one. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. All right. 2 times 90 is what? 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 100. 110, 120, 130, 140, 150, 160, 170, 180. So 2 times 90. 180. All right. Two times 90. Two times nine. See that? 180 is 10 times as much as 18. Multiply by a multiple of 10, your product increase by the same multiple of 10. All right. Now we have two times 900. So two groups knees, y'all. Two groups of 900. 100 square, flat, whatever you're going to call it. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. That's terrible. 
When you multiply by a multiple of 10, your product increases by a multiple of 10. Okay? All right. That's what we're doing, kiddos. Focus. Think about your place value chart. Each hop is a times 10. When you multiply by a multiple of 10, you're going to increase your product by a multiple of 10. All right? Okie dokie. Setting the stage for multiplying big, big numbers because you're fourth graders and you're smart. All right, so knock out that assignment. You guys are awesome. Bye.